Developing news now four deadly shootings are under investigation this morning. They all happened within a few hours and not too far apart from each other. Two of the shootings were near schools. KTLA's Omar Lewis is live in the city of Bell with the details. Good morning, Omar. Yeah, good morning, Eric. We're talking about a very violent and deadly three hour time frame here in the Cudahy Bell area. Four people killed in a matter of hours all around midnight Monday, including a 14 year old boy this morning. Parents, residents, police who we spoke to all say they are on high alert. We can show you a map and the timeline. These killings happened within a five mile radius between 1130 Sunday night and 2:30 a.m. Monday. The first shooting was reported in the 6000 block of Bear Avenue before midnight Monday. A man was shot to death near the Martha Estate. Scudia Primary Center. The school was closed Monday morning because of the homicide investigation happening right outside of the campus there. Another man shot to death less than two miles away in the 1500 block of East Florence Avenue around 1208 AM. Let's take you to video now. Just minutes later, a 14 year old killed outside of the Ellen Ochoa Learning Center on Live Oak Street in Cudahy. Another teen also shot in that case, but is expected to survive around 230 AM Monday. A fourth man was shot to death on Santa Fe Avenue in Huntington Park after police officers out there were on patrol spotted a person lying in the street near a curb. Again, two of these shootings happened right near schools at the Ellen Ochoa Learning Center. The body of the 14 year old boy was still on the ground as children as young as five walked to school. Parents there say they were not properly notified by the school district. Take, take a listen. When it's raining that we get alerts immediately right away, but for a body, we didn't really hear anything until like eight o'clock in the morning. Obviously this is gang related. There's, there's tagging all over these cities now and it's, you know, the police should take this serious and you know, things should be done about this. Right now, investigators say these shootings are not linked, but they could be gang related. No suspects in any of these cases have been arrested. If you have any information in these cases, you're asked to pick up the phone and call the L.A. County Sheriff's Department. That's the very latest here live in Bell this morning. We'll send it back to you in Hollywood.